really believe that the opposite of addiction is connection. So it's about building relationships and giving people a multitude of pathways to be able to walk the path with us. The mission of East Coast Recovery Center is to provide the best care possible for clients. What Brian and I have tried to build here is a place where people can get that same experience that we had. We were trying to provide a space um, in a community where people can connect, feel like they're not alone, understand that other people have walked this path before, uh, and come out better for it. We're just south of the city, so we still have the city fun and entertainment and different things to do, but we're also far enough away to where we have nature and different rivers and mountains and different things to do for adventure type stuff. The access to our walking trails and beaches and outdoor activities that we get to incorporate into recovery here is, is amazing. We have areas to sort of do a little bit of rock climbing, tons of conservation area with trails for walking and mountain biking. Someone might feel safer at the beach to talk about how they're feeling as opposed to sitting in a circle in a group room. They need to know that they're not here just for a clinical structure, that they need to learn how to live again in a fun and entertaining way. They need to learn how to have fun. I mean, I can't emphasize that enough to have fun without a drink or a drug. Holistic therapy, including yoga and meditation, is very important to us. I think that sometimes a holistic approach can really make you feel kind of centered with yourself and kind of feel things that maybe you wouldn't feel um, in a different group setting. Mindfulness and therapy and yoga plays into recovery because this is a threefold disease in mind, body, and spirit. Um, and I think yoga really settles down the mind to really just help teach people to sit with oneself. There are modalities that will work for people and there are modalities that won't. And so we meet clients where they're at. There's no cookie cutter answer to recovery. So it's bring the client in, understand their experience, understand their experience to date with both using and attempts at recovery and see what we can do different. I want clients to feel uh, comfortable when they get here, feel like this is a place where change can start to happen. And I really want someone to feel like the people here really care about them or they're part of like a bigger culture and family where we all care about each other. We've done this. We know what it's like to be at that bottom. We've come out the other side and we're here to help. <laughs>